What's up everybody? Here we go again. I'm Freaktography, Urbex Dave. Outside we got Carlo Pelotza. Not with us today is Rhythm Rider. Today Carlo and I are checking out a whole street full of abandoned houses. Next door, we just checked out an abandoned drug dealer's mansion with uh, armored, protective armored uh, windows around the house. And now I'm next door and I'm at a much smaller abandoned house. So we're gonna check this one out, stretch it out as long as we can, cue the music, cue the intro, let's go. Damp down here. We still have power. <laughs> the water heater's still running. We got a light on in this room. Very strange, very strange. Very tight back here. There's a bathroom in there. Yeah, so I'll bet you if I turn the water on, we're going to have hot water. I think Carlo's still outside. Very damp. There's our door we came in. We're going to turn around. We're going to go upstairs and hope we don't get murdered. Let's go get it. Got recent fresh footprints in here. We got raccoon footprints. Anybody in here? Don't want to disturb anybody if you're in here. All right, what do we got in here? We just got this room. That's about it. Got a Coca-Cola bottle right there. Probably came from the house next door. All right, here's our kitchen. Pretty small kitchen. And then here is our living room area. Again, it's fresh footprints. Whoa, the floor's a little soggy. Fireplace, window, curtains. Oh, well, this is a small house. I don't know if I can stretch this out much longer. Somebody's already ripped out the copper. What's uh, what have we got through here? There's your front door. Wide open front door. Go over here. Into the garage. And there's nothing in the garage. So that pretty much wraps it up for this one, guys. So what I think I'm going to do here is as I'm exploring on this road full of abandoned houses, I'm just gonna merge a few houses into one video because this house isn't worth uh, its video on its own. So we're gonna keep exploring. I'm gonna go find Carlo and we're gonna move on to the next house. Ah! <laughs> you got me a little bit, you got me a little bit. Okay guys, that's it for this house. I'm gonna turn this thing off and we're gonna hit the next one. See you in a bit. Okay guys, welcome to the second part of this video. Last house we were at, very small, old abandoned house. Next one we're in, it's a very retro 80s, 70s, 80s sort of feel to it. So we're gonna take a walk through this house and check it out as the second half of this video. So we're not gonna cue the music, we're not gonna cue the intro, we're just gonna keep on going. So let's turn the camera around and let's go. All right. Dark brown. This room is very dark brown. Brown wood paneling. Nice brown curtains, hey? All right. There's the UBC having a seat, taking a break. Check out this kitchen here. A little bit of an old uh, 70s and 80s era kitchen with a nice new dishwasher and all this wood that had been smashed all to hell. 
So this is your kitchen, folks. This is your kitchen here. Somebody got behind the walls to take all the copper, as usual. Here we got this really, really fancy wallpaper here. Let's get a good zoom in on this wallpaper here. Can you see that? Nice paisley wallpaper. This interesting door with this weird window. Moving right along, we have a bedroom here with a really nice puke yellow curtain. And, uh, and puke uh, poop green carpeting. Really nice, really nice. Moving right along. Hey, I have a question. Yeah. That green couch, which mansion was it in the one of the Mitsubishi's or the other one? The other one. The other Mitsubishi? No, the other one. The one beside the one with Mitsubishi with Mitsubishi. Was it? Yeah. That was the one with the staircase. So here we have a bedroom with a toilet on the floor. So here is where your bed your bathroom was right there. And there's me, what is up guys? And you've got your toilet on the floor, okay? And uh, again, garbage looking carpet and uh, really ugly, ugly decor. Really ugly decor. Moving on, another bathroom here, folks. No, oh yeah, there's the toilet. The toilet's been ripped out of, the, out of the hole. And you've got your bathtub slash shower. And uh, they left a towel behind for us. This is really nice of them. And look at this, look at this beautiful green, puke snot green wallpaper, it's nice. Moving right along into the master bedroom, or another bedroom, dark purple, dark purple carpet, curtains I should say. What's this thing? Some fancy thing there, and you've got purple walls and dark purple curtains. Moving along, we've got a very fancy light fixture right here on the ceiling and back to your door there and now I don't know the basement's probably going to be crap but we'll go down and take a look anyways. I never like going in the basement, it's going to be all dusty and gross. All right, here we go. Oh. Dusty, cold, and spider webs everywhere. So here's your rec room. They've stripped the stuff off the walls. You've got a really, really nice fireplace here. And then check this out. Floor to ceiling pole lamp. That is left behind. This must have been a pretty cool room, I bet, in its, in its day. This was probably a really cool rec room. I wish that it didn't get all... Uh, Dismantled because I'd like to see what it looked like. I got spider webs all over my face right now, folks. There's your stairs, storage. This is probably the old man's workshop. You got a bathroom and another room. There you go. Going too fast because there's nothing to see. Head back upstairs. to the UBC. Hey, that rhymes. So I think my favorite part of the root of the house here is this kitchen. It's probably my favorite part. My second favorite part of this house is the UBC. <laughs> so that pretty much does it. That's this place. So that's going to be Two houses, one video. UBC, UBD, UBJ. Subscribe, follow, smash. See you next time.